What's going on guys? This is Chris. And Nalia. And Daniel. I got my fat well partner, most of my family here. I'm missing the little one, the little one stayed behind. Today's adventure, we're gonna go ahead and dive into something really cool here in where's it located at, honey? Bradenton, Florida. Bradenton, Florida, guys. It's a, I guess a rope course. It's an obstacle course where you can go and you're pretty much most of the obstacles are like 50 feet above the ground. Yep, probably, yeah, around there. You ready for this, Danny? Are you gonna be yeah, able to conquer all of them? What? Are you gonna be able to conquer all of them? Yeah, actually, you're good to them. How about you, Blondie? I'm ready. The reason, guys, guys. So let's let's dig back. This is our second time here. So the reason why Daniel said he actually did good today. The first time we came here, she stopped at Dunkin' Donuts and got Danny some hash browns. They were terrible, guys. They were overcooked. And Danny, tell him your experience with that. Oh, it was horrible. I had like no energy. <laughs> The poor boy made it with just waters, guys. They have like little water stations that you grab waters in between obstacles, and he was pretty much dying. He couldn't, I don't know how he completed it, but we got through the whole course. Uh, so we're gonna take you guys along, and hopefully you guys have a wonderful time and able to uh, embody our adventure throughout our experience. And hopefully you guys come out here and try it one of these days. Again, the place is called Triumph. It's a pretty cool place, and we'll go ahead and take you guys to the whole place. So toodles. Doodles. We're here getting ready guys, We're getting ready to do this cool adventure course right here at Danny fixing his harness. Getting everything ready? You ready yeah, buddy? I'm not trying to die. <laughs> we got ready. here mama bear taking care of her little cubs, making sure everything's good to go. Yes. Making sure his butt strap is trapped on. How about you boo-boo? You ready? I'm ready. I think so. You ready? You got ready? this. You ready? Got you ready? This. Got this. Ooh, games. We're out here at Triumph in where again, hun? Bradenton, 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 Florida. So we're gonna go through all these cool little obstacles and go down zip lining and kind of challenge our inner activists and making sure we are able to go through all these cool courses, guys. Look at that. So should be pretty cool. Make sure everything's good and ready for a cool adventure. So the steps today is to challenge ourselves, make sure we can do all and everything out here, making sure we can complete all and every obstacles and be part of Savage Escapes, guys. We're literally taking ourselves and forcing ourselves above anything that we think we weren't able to do and just making sure we can do it. So let's go ahead and have some fun. What's going on, guys? We're back here again. We're just finished a five minute tutorial video of what to do throughout the road course. And we got here, everybody just practicing before you go into the actual course and make it take like a kind of like a practice and if you pass you're able to go out into the course we got here everybody practicing let's get going in our time here daniel practicing the zip line and we're getting ready to go out here and see what this course is all about so let's have some fun get this day started and hopefully we'll make it through the whole thing wow. Wait, what? Remember when you finish obstacle five, yeah. they give you a free drink? Yeah. So, but before it was beer, now it's any beer. Nice. Ah! Almost fell. I need some water, how about you? Yeah, it's coming right up. Third obstacle, and it already got me breathing. How are you guys? Imagine coming out here, doing it. The cool thing is, obstacle five is supposed to be the hardest obstacle out here. And if you complete obstacle five, you got a free beer ticket, was it? It's a drink ticket now. Like you can get any drink at this local um, restaurant nearby. So, local restaurant, either free beer or free food. So 
I don't know about you guys, but that's a pretty good incentive to complete obstacle five. So I'll bring you guys along for obstacle five. Let's see what happens and what we bring. here in trio uh, pretty tiring course it's really freaking fun good way to test yourself and i don't overcome obstacles and fear because your voice is pretty high above the ground I'm like Whoa! but you can overcome your fears and just dive at it and you can pretty much test yourself and overcome some amazing things one of the other long obstacles uh here the zip line so we're gonna go on it see how far sorry about the bad hair head strap is messing it up let's have some fun Yeah! Guys, we're back here. What obstacle number is this? Guy? Number three. So, these people actually want me to go in this little plywood with this little cloth gloves and make it to the other. And expect me somehow to put my foot in these holes. So, let's try it. Maybe. Be. I can't stretch that far, man. Ah! Oh god! Oh god! Ah. Back here in the trees, guys. You know, we're still combating, we just switched over the second obstacle, the third obstacle, excuse me, to station four. And it is not a pleasant one. We're starting to get to the more advanced courses. About to ride a skateboard through the woods. On top of the woods, suspended, guys. About a Tony Hawk on him. What's going on, guys? Chris coming back at you. Just finished the road course. Finished the final zip line out here at Trium. The staff was freaking amazing. They're very helpful. Uh, they have an amazing facility, very clean, very professional. Everybody was more than willing to help out if you got stuck in any of them. And we're able to complete all this rope course. Here's Daniel coming right now, finishing the rope course. So that's it for Triumph, guys. It was freaking amazing. The wife here. Did you have a great time, babe? Oh, yeah. How was the staff here? They were amazing. How you like the courses? It was very amazing. Are you tired? Extremely. Very sunny, very hot here in Florida, guys. It's about 95 degrees outside today. Hi, I'm Steven. I'm starving. I drank like about a gallon of water throughout the whole course. Like I said, they have a lot of water stations out here. So you're able to get water as you see fit and 
if you are coming to check out this adventure guys I strongly recommend you have a good healthy breakfast a lot of water guys because you're gonna sweat more than you ever thought you will before like I said guys I work out on an everyday basis this kicked my butt and sorry about the terrible hair because yeah I'm not looking too fresh too hot right now guys I actually need a haircut so wow but we're gonna go ahead wrap this up here at triumph guys we're gonna go ahead and go throughout and uh, uh, turn all the gear back in and then we'll come back at you thank you love you guys hey guys What's so up? we're gonna eat I'm because exhausted. we're starving i'm super red from the whole <sighs> festivities tired. we are so we're gonna eat right here at truman's. truman's tap and grill because we earned a free drink or three because we all completed the fifth obstacle so we're gonna go eat daniel here, babe. hold my hand <laughs> i have to hold daniel's Stop. hand because daniel doesn't know how to freaking behave him. Hold, hold my hand hold your daddy's hand hold your daddy's hand so we're gonna have some lunch guys we'll be back at you thank you for listening so just finish a great meal i am stuffed thank you letting me pass what a nice human beings out here everybody's so beautiful and nice up here I wish people were this nice in tampa but I'm stuffed, guys. I definitely have the itis after eating that much food. How are you feeling? That was really good. Daniel ate more than both me and Ali can buy. Yeah. <laughs> he tore his whole plate up. I had like I a half of my burrito, and that was it. You yes, you're driving because my legs are not working right now. So <laughs> we're gonna go ahead and end our beautiful day in downtown tonight. So just a quick recap: of what just happened? Oh, we just had lunch, then go to the rest of the day. Thank you, guys. What's up guys? We're back, we're back, we're back, we're back! Heading to downtown. Uh, there's a hot air balloon festival. Is it a festival? Yeah, it's like a glow thing. I guess like a glow kind of thing. They have live music and stuff like that. So we're out here looking good. Look at, look at this bouncy. Look at that, look at that. Mm. We're out here. We're gonna have some fun. We got a couple of our friends today. We're gonna go out to the town, have some fun, maybe a couple of drinks and just finish off our day that way. Canelo fights tonight, so we're gonna make sure that's gonna be lit because Team Canelo all the way. Let's get it, guys. The craziest thing just happened, guys. Me and Danny were sitting in Riverwalk. It's a place in downtown Tampa, and I just told him today Lance is in town, and he was like, no way. So he looked, it up, looked at one of his videos and saw that he was in town. So we're just chilling there. We're actually planning to do something funny, and. He kind of backed out, but um, I saw Lance out the corner of my eyes, and I told Danny, "Could that be him?" And show him that. Show him real quick. Show him real quick. Hey, he got to meet him, guys. We got to meet Lance. He was an amazing guy, a pretty stand-up individual. He was pretty cool, very friendly, and was very opening to us, and just kind of hugged it out, and was able to take a picture on. So really cool. How are you feeling about that, Danny? Oh, I screamed. I was like, Lance! That was freaking awesome, guys. So just thought we shared that with you guys. Thanks again for kind of tuning in with us and coming along. So we'll, we'll catch you guys on the next them. one. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Let me introduce you guys to our best friends right here. We got the beautiful. I'm a Barbie girl in a Barbie world. Say hi, Shay. How you doing, my girl? Hi. hi, hello. I know you guys keep the, he's hard to see, but he's there. Right She's here. coming. Right here, right here. <laughs> Leaving her. <laughs> We're gonna go here now. She's gonna get so. Damn, baby mama! Hey! What do that look? Alright, ma'am. You look like a lost piggy. Can I be your ride? The downward is this way. Hey. You fine, girl. Hmm. Are you tired? Because I've been running through your mind all day. Jim, you pulling moves on me? Why did you pulling moves on me? I thought I was pulling moves on her. Ah! <laughs> I'll be pissed. Bro, my, I, my sister just said she's a Fernandez again. Welcome to Uber. How may I help you? Bienvenidos a Uber. Come on, I'll put it out of your door. Can you give me a ride? I got you, homie. 